What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Empress Mind Thing the 254, and I'm back with another video. And today, I want to congratulate France on winning and getting their spot on the finals in Belgium. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Good luck to England and Croatia. Whoever is going to win, though, I'm go England for now. Um, so I want you to like, comment, subscribe, and turn the post notification. We we'll back and figure out what I'm gonna be doing for y'all today. Who knows? A scrub is a guy that thinks he's fine. This also known as a buster. Always talking about what he wants and just sits on his broke ass. So no, I don't want your number. No, I don't wanna give you mine. So today we're gonna talk about um. The two universities I've been to, and universities in Kenya in general, because they're not different, just the rules are kind of all the same. And the stress of registration, same old stuff, guys. So I studied in Barton University and I, and for three years. And for me, Barton had its struggles, it was fun, but um, I remember the first time I walked into Barton, I was like, where am I going? Because the first place you enter the gate, there's a church on the left. Then there's a huge sign saying no drugs or alcohol in past this zone. Then you go straight and you meet the admin and every like the buildings are old and everything. Then um like because you know I was coming from like an American school and all the schools I was looking at from the US, like all had the dorms looking all nice and everything. So when I went to the dorms, I was like Eh, man, mom, why are you stop? Why are you, where are you dropping me? Oh, seriously, where is this? So, um, I literally cried. I'm not even gonna lie. And it was the first time I left home, and I haven't been to boarding school and everything. Then it was a registration process of getting myself into the Barton system. You know, I walked up and down. If you guys are in Barra, you know that struggle of going from finance to um admin to saco to um the dorm the ladies dorm for approvals to wherever you need to get those signatures it's just a hustle and yearbook and everything um which you probably won't even get the yearbook at the end of the year because they never give it to you anyway um also like so when i came to choir let me start talking about how the registration was um got my acceptance letter really fast and then so Kwea is catholic university of eastern africa for those who do not know what it stands for yeah and so okay so basically um we had a group we had to meet in one room people who were doing the bachelors of commerce meet in one group group and then bachelors of law meet in another room and you're basically you register together then you have to go and activate your account for your system it was a bit less hectic as than Byrton because Byrton had so many because you I was living on campus and also even if you lived off campus there was also other rules that you had to go with so I guess um also in Quea there's no hostels inside of the school so you can't really say if i was coming to this university i'm gonna be living on campus there's no such thing as that everyone lives off campus and it's like two different rules when you get off campus and when you're in school um basically rules are the same um when it comes to dress code just dress decently you can be coming out in a spaghetti strap and strapless shirts and um mini dresses and everything you gotta dress for success you get what I mean? <laughs> you get it you get it anyway. so um yeah what else church Barrison church was like crazy so you have to go to church monday basically monday to monday from six to seven um friday since the seventh day Adventist, you had to go friday from seven to eight thirty those who are in Barra, comment below and tell me if i'm saying anything wrong because you know and yeah, so you had to go to church Friday, Saturday, for the Sabbath. And then the rest were like chapels, and Wednesday was Vespers. 
so like after a long day of class lord i love you but sometimes when it comes to like you being like you drive, you have to go to church like being forced to go to church it was kind of like yeah no but in choir is just one day on thursday and it's optional though it's mandatory but people don't go <laughs> so um um also being able to go to school three times a week is pretty interesting because i used to, we used to have classes monday to friday then maybe have a class on sunday in Barra. um so yeah anything else i don't think there's anything much different it's just that i'm in a catholic university now and before it was a seventh before it was a seventh day and seventh days are a bit more stricter with religion wise um i don't know guys what else am i missing hmm. oh also like the food the food in Baratin was <laughs> literally monday to sunday you would know the menu like it never changed like if it changed it's just because we're having fries in like once in the semester after that it's beans rice and cabbage that was not even cooked well but i'm not dissing biotin it's just i'm trying to say that it's a bit different um so you just have beans beans um cabbage rice then we had um ugali and scrambled eggs and we used to make like down downstairs the cafeteria there used to be like these mandazis made out of mandazis that are sandwiches so you put eggs ca um lettuce no eggs tomatoes onions and green pepper and then you put your ketchup you put your pili pili then you put your salt inside it it wasn't bad the first time maybe you're like what is this but after some time you get used to it you're like it's actually this is really good and it becomes an addiction just like here we have pasua which is like chapos and um smokies and either bajias or fries so if you ever want to come to Kwea, try the pasua they're really nice depending on where you go though um what else? I think classes are longer here than Barton because with Barton we were in again we were in school so um, it used to be an hour for each class but you'd have it more than once in a week. Here literally you have that one class in a day and it'll be three hours long. So like probably stay for the whole day from like eight to five. We have like three three courses but after three hours of class you just stay like I'm going to go in my bed but anyway um i think that's it um nothing different in the sense of like social socializing everyone is the same like everyone's nice da, da, da. it's easy to make friends here as well even in bar it was easy to make friends um the cats are not different. Like I, used, I thought that I would like cry when I started. I did my first cat here, but it wasn't bad. Um, looking, have cats and like have an, have exams in like two weeks, so I will probably not be filming for some time till after exams, or I'll film extra. So if you guys have any other idea of what I should film about, comment down below, and then we'll have the discussion, and I'll decide which ideas I'll go for. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. Hit that red button and give that bell a ring a ding a ding a ding. Um, and I'll see you next time. Bye! So, I forgot to tell you guys about um, that. Like, the difference between eating in Bara and eating here was is the fact that we buy our own lunch, you know? And you have to budget <laughs> for the lunch. I also remember you, you're like taking your jiving to school. Those who do not know what jiving is, you take my tattoo to school. So it's like um, you have to make sure you've, you've budgeted for transport. So basically, you're learning how to be a grown up and everything. 
so you make sure oops sorry. <laughs> it's a cobweb um so um yeah like for us it was a set menu here it's like the only thing you can probably find is like fries ojias chapos like in good places like you have to know the right places to go i'm still looking for the best place so if you inquire and you know where i can get really good chapos and dangles call me up be a little date you know <laughs> anyway <laughs> so that's all i have for y'all i'm out and pressed out yeah.